it's that time of the month again. We have the Bass Fishing Extra Large Lucky Tackle Box to unbox for the month of August. Let's see what is inside. We got some decorative wrapping. Can't take that fish in. So first thing I see in here is this. Oh, oh wow. I am on the cover. They didn't tell me that. That's pretty neat. I'm right there. Little Guggen looking face. Apparently it says what's in the box. Well, I'm about to tell you what's in the box. This little thing has just a lot of tips on fishing. It's got a lot of discounts, some promo codes you can use to save money. Um, it, like I said, it teaches you how to fish, so it, it's definitely my favorite part. Although these lures are pretty sweet, this dude right here will teach you how to catch the fish, which is why I like it the most. So we've got one, two, three, four, seven, 27, 32, five. We've got seven baits in here and then a couple other items. They are on this card. If you want to know the official prices and the total of this entire box, check the description. I'll put that down there. I don't know why I even have a knife out here. I'll get into the coolest bait. I usually just start with the coolest bait because I can. And this one here is a Boyd Duckett Castake BD Series swim bait. I probably just broke it now. This little dude right here is a Castake swim bait like I had said. That thing is freaking sweet looking actually. it's It's got this magnetic hook which I've never seen before. Check that out. That's pretty sweet. I'm not I'm not huge into swim baits. It's just not a really big thing in the Midwest. It's something that I want to do. And I'm definitely going to be going to California. I think in September. I'm going to Canada this week. California hopefully in September. Texas in September at some point. But I definitely want to learn how to throw these swim baits right here. This dude will, right here will run you 20 bucks retail. That's pretty crazy, but it does look very lifelike. Got a very nice paint job in there. It's a shad color. It could imitate a crappie. It could imitate a shad. Any type of bait fish that you have. So it probably works anywhere in the country. Next bait is my second favorite. That is a Lunker Hunt frog. This is one of their frogs, like those lifelike legs, but this one is a little different. It's new, fairly new. I believe it came out maybe like last year. It looks like this. It's got some nice lifelike legs to it. But this one's got a popper, so I've thrown the normal ones, but I haven't thrown the one with like the cup. And you guys know I love I throw, love throwing popping frogs. I don't really know why. It's just kind of a confidence thing for me. But they came out with this one that uh, that has the pop thing, and I think it's mouse color. That's what it looks like to me. So it's a something a little bit different. It's not your traditional bullfrog colored frog. It's going to be something that that's different. The fish probably haven't seen this. They're used to seeing the spaghetti legs, as I call it. These ones look way more realistic and this son of a gun will run you seven dollars and 99 cents retail definitely going to be throwing this next time i go frog fishing next we have this guy right here this is a sabeel vibe machine it's a little lipless crankbait made by sabeel pretty interesting color to be honest with you it's got an orange belly kind of a chartreuse or like an aqua color looking looking body on it but uh Got some solid rattles to it, very sharp hooks on it. Fall is approaching. Unfortunately, I'm not a huge fan of fall because that means winter is next. But fishing lipless crankbaits work really well in the fall, so I know I will be chucking this dude right here around in about a month or two. Yeah, that'll go $5.99. I don't know if I told you that. Next, we got another uh, hard bait. This is the last hard bait and got a couple soft plastics and some terminal tackle. This one is a jerk bait. This jerk bait is made by Chasing Trophy Fish. It sounds to me like it's a new brand. It's something that I've never even heard of, uh, but I'm kind of out of the loop when it comes to brands, to be honest with you. I just don't have time to really keep up to date, but this bait looks pretty sweet. It looks like a little baby bass, like almost like a baby fry. So this thing would be super ideal to throw right, right around post-spawn. But again, like just like lipless crankbaits work once that water starts to cool off, jerkbaits work just as well, if not even better. So throwing a little shallow running jerkbait like this when those, when those bass chase those shad up shallow in the fall. They feed, they chase them shallow. A little shallow running jerkbait like that would work great. That would run you $7.50. That's all for the hard baits. We got two soft plastics here. Uh, I'll start with this guy here. So this, this is a company that obviously I knew existed, but I didn't know they made fishing lures. That's Vicious Tackle. Vicious Fishing, they make fishing lines, but I guess now they make lures. The lure that came in this month's Lucky Tackle Box is the tube. It's called the Tubby Tube. It is just your standard like four four inch green pumpkin watermelon looking uh, looking color. I think it's actually watermelon black flake. But it's just your standard tube and you don't see me use tubes a lot and that's because they work really well up north and I don't fish up north a whole lot. When you're fishing for small mouths, tubes like this just absolutely crush it. So I'm headed to Canada next week. By the time you're seeing this video, I'm probably already there. Tubes, I'm definitely gonna be taking with me. They catch a ton of fish, a lot of big fish. And they just catch a lot of fish in general. They're just really good baits. It's something that I don't use a whole lot but really need to start using more. And these go for $3.99. So the last bait is this guy right here. This is a Cabin Creek worm. It's a, it's a, called a buoy worm. 
And this guy, this guy is hollow. I don't know how many hollow worms I've... This is a hollow worm. Why is a hollow worm good? The reason why it's good is because air is trapped inside it, and it, when you put it in water, it tries to get out, so it rises to the surface. So if you're throwing a drop shot and your worm's sitting like this, the air is going to keep it kind of up, and it's not going to sag down. So same thing with a shaky head. If your shaky head is down on the ground like this, the air will push the worm straight up in the air, which just gives a better presentation, more lifelike action. These dudes go for $5.79. Last but not least for the box is a pack of terminal tackle. These are must-add treble hooks. Treble hooks are something that a lot of guys don't think about changing, especially after you, you, know, you have your favorite crankbait, you catch maybe 50 bass on it in a matter of weeks. Those hooks are gonna be dull. It's just, that's just what happens. I don't care what brand of hooks you have, they're eventually gonna dull out. So what you wanna do is you wanna take these guys right here. These are must-add triple grips, some of the best hooks on the market. And you wanna put them on the baits that have dull hooks. So it doesn't even have to be the baits that came in this box. If you've got the Lucky Tackle box, go find your favorite crankbait, feel those hooks, and if they are dull, slap some of those bad boys on there right there. And these will earn you $4.99. Lucky Tackle box sticker. And I think that's it. That's all the baits that came in this month's Lucky Tackle box. Like I said, if you wanna know the final price, what everything costs combined, go check the description. If you would like your own Lucky Tackle Box, you guys, all you have to do is go to LuckyTackleBox.com and you can sign up. This is the Bass XL Box. They have a regular Bass Box. They've got walleye. they got panfish. they got ice fishing. they got a whole bunch of stuff. So no matter where you're at in the country, no matter what season it is, they will have a box for you. Use promo code FLAIR and you will get 10 bucks off your first box. But that's what was in the box for August. I sincerely hope you guys enjoy. Hopefully you guys aren't getting tired of unboxings. I, like I said, I'm going to be in Canada. I'm probably in Canada when you're watching this, which means I'm fishing for seven days straight, which means you guys are going to see tons and tons of fishing content. So bear with me. Be patient. Trust me, I've got some good fishing videos coming soon. If you enjoy the unboxings, leave a like. Other than that, appreciate you guys sticking through this video, and thanks for watching. I just got about two and a half, three pounder right there.